Yeah. At first, she was scared of the mask. But I tried to comfort her. Hey, nothing bad is gonna happen, and I'm here. One day, I noticed she was breathing heavily and wasn't dismotivated. She developed problems with endurance, so I let my doctor check her lung and he diagnosed the chronic asthma. She is normally a very motivated horse and wants to run, but she was not the same. So I let her use the inhaler every day. And at first she was very skeptical because it's a weird thing to have on the head. But she knows it's the best for her. So she now enjoys it and relaxes. We have a bit of a problematic year. She also has atrocious in her leg and it was very bad and she didn't want to walk but she got her medication and after three months we could start again still she's just super motivated to do new things if she does it and she gets a treat or your laugh or something she just continues to do it she's obsessed with giving kisses when you do this with your finger, you point it to your cheek, she does the kiss. She does the sprinkler, as I would call it. One day she drank and she started nodding her head. And from then, she always did it. And she's like, yeah, makes you laugh, I do it again. I also asked the vet if everything's okay and he said it's unproblematic. She's just the funniest and loveliest horse I've ever met. I got her when I was nine years old and she was a little foal. It was love at first sight and she started following me around immediately. Now I'm 25 years old and she is 16. And that's like my whole life. And we grew up together, we learned together and we shared so many beautiful memories. Then also bad things happening like the asthma or the atrocious. But I will always care for her and do what's best for her. She's the love of my life. She's my happy place and I really can't imagine life without her.